Brain Tech here, where tech is made simple. The Microsoft Edge web browser for desktop, as many of you may know, has a feature called Efficiency Mode, which lets you put inactive tabs to sleep after a specified amount of time. And that um, period of inactivity ranges from 30 seconds of inactivity right through to 12 hours of inactivity. Now, according to a new and recent patch over on uh, Chromium Garrett, it seems that we may be getting a very similar feature being added to Google Chrome for desktop uh, in the future. Now, uh, just to do a quick recap, um, in case you're unaware, recently Google rolled out a new performance page to the stable version of Chrome on desktop, which gives you a memory saver and an energy saver, and the memory saver frees up memory from, from inactive tabs. So it's very similar to what we get in the Edge web browser, uh, where it can put inactive tabs to sleep, so saving you system resources while using the browser. Now, um, as mentioned, according to a new and recent patch over on Chromium Garrett, uh, it seems that we may be getting um, a very similar feature um, where we can adjust the time period and the time frame uh, to discard inactive tabs and put those tabs to sleep in the Chrome web browser to free up memory. And heading over to the first patch, yeah, we can see discard inactive tab after. And if we head to the second patch, yeah, we get three time frames and three intervals. Two hours, five minutes, and five seconds. Now, it doesn't give us a lot of options. We only get three at this stage, but it does um, suggest that Google uh, is, is working on the feature uh, to put in active tabs to sleep and discard in active tabs after two hours, five minutes, and five seconds. And to put this all into perspective, if we head back to the performance page in the settings menu, that will eventually appear on this page if and when it does roll out to Google Chrome, giving you the option, as mentioned, to put those inactive tabs to sleep and discard inactive tabs. And um, over those three intervals, you can have the choice to select out of the three, and then that will free up memory, thereby saving you system resources, as mentioned, very similar to what we get over currently in the Microsoft Edge web browser. And obviously, um, this will, first of all, um, roll out to the Canary version of Chrome, which is the preview version, where obviously uh, Google will test that, and then it will work its way down. If it does uh, go through official testing, it will work its way down the dev beta, and then finally get to the stable version in the future. And if that does happen, and, in, and if I do get any more info, I will obviously post and let you know. So thanks for watching, and I will see you in the next one.